Howdy folks, it's a tall turtle here. Welcome back to Survivor Craft. Yes, it's been a long time. But we're back, back in the swing of things. Real life had some stuff going on. And I just had to take a little break for a while and then work on some textures to kind of distract myself. But we're back. We should be back to some regular uploads again. Hopefully. It's not gonna be daily, but it should be regular. But otherwise, we are hanging out by our campfire. Not too close though. We don't want to burn our feet. And I want to give a special shout out to JJ who's been watching my videos. Hopefully you're practicing clarinet there, buddy, and also enjoying some Minecraft. Alright, let's see. Those embers are going to get me in the head. I don't think they're going to be damage inducing if they get me. But anyway, we are going to be enjoying some of my own textures finally in Survivor Craft as well. I was going to do an episode where I just point out the new textures, but you can just watch my texture pack videos for that. Otherwise, we have a few odds and ends to do today, and we have a big flight ahead of us. Hopefully, okay, it's midday. I'm trying to time everything here. We have a big flight ahead of us because in the next episode, we are finally going to build my little island getaway house. I've been wanting to do this since the beginning. I've always had an, uh, a vision of having my main base. Actually, this was going to be my starter base. <laughs> the jungle was going to be the main base, but this is our main base. And then we were going to have a tiny island... Oop, that got my foot. A little tiny island getaway home. And then we're going to have a little jungle getaway home. So I picked out a spot for the jungle home. I finally picked out a spot for the... Um, I'm scanning for monsters if you're wondering what I'm doing. Because of leftover stuff. And I finally picked out a spot for my island home. So we're going to do some odds and ends in this episode. If I can get myself back up here. There we go. And then we're going to fly to our island area. We're going to claim it. And then in the next episode, we're going to build a little tiny house, a little island house. And we will start there from time to time. Also, we have to go back and visit Turtle Park, too. So as I'm walking along here, I'm enjoying how my seeds have grown. But I don't think we need them that close together. This actually wasn't on my to-do list today. But we're going to do it anyway. Um, I just want to fill this in here. Let's see, let's see every other one. Will those grow on pods though? I guess we're gonna find out together, aren't we? Um, wait, I need to go through th there to get to my thing. So never mind. we'll just keep it like that. Let's see if those grow, I'm curious. I'm curious if they're gonna grow. This, why don't we just stack these together? There we go, awesome. So a couple things I wanna do on my to-do list. First of all, we're gonna assemble our citizen from Anope, from our tour, holding, bringing us a gift. Um, if we see anybody, we'll give them the Tigger It, but I don't plan on seeing anybody today, to be honest. Or tonight, I should say. And I need to see if there's this patrol. Yes. I logged in briefly to check a few things and prep for recording, and there's a patrol over here. My first one ever. Am I really going to run over that every single time I walk through there? Oh, gosh. That poor... The poor squid. Oh, buddy, you beached yourself. Let's just take your... Yeah. Oh, there you go. So let's see if that patrol is still over here. Um, I don't know. Maybe he despawned. He was there, there a second to go. So what we're actually going to do... I didn't mean to do this. I meant to go through here. Turtle Studio, which is somewhere else we have to visit. I keep expecting things to spawn in here. But everything is above light level 7. So um, Let's run up here. Look at my new textures above the, the flames, above the candles. Above the... Whatchamacallit. Torches. Speaking of which... I'll mention this in my texture pack up to video too. Um, oh, while we're up here, by the way, we I also figured out my base expansion, which will be a separate episode with Dynamap and everything. So I have thought about my base expansion into this area. Just be aware I'm thinking of all these things. So even though I haven't been recording Survivor Craft, I've been thinking about it regularly. But anyway, um, oh, I think the patrol left. Shoot, I was saying a couple things I already forgot. <laughs> like I say all the time. In real life, I'm super duper organized. So in Minecraft, I let myself be not as organized. So this is a pretty view. Oh, something else I totally forgot to mention. We're using shaders and my anti-aliasing is working again. Um, I figured out what it was after troubleshooting off and on for a couple weeks. Somehow when I was clicking around... Um, okay, this is where that patrol was. When I was clicking around... Oh, maybe they just spawned. Bummer, I was going to get my first patrol with you all on camera. Aww. They're gone. Well, that's a huge bummer. They were just here. Um. Oh well. Anyway, there they are. There they are. 
Hey guys, there's only two of them though. Actually, oh, you, you shot your buddy. Um, there we go. I'm gonna get my milk before we get a raid. Although I don't think we meet the requirements for a raid because I don't have any villagers, even though I have beds. And I don't have any like um. Of oh my gosh, oh we're going fast because I'm like we're going so fast because we're within beacon range. Um, I don't think I meet requirements for a village here, so we're not going to get a raid anyway. Um, otherwise, I'm just checking things out because this remember this part of the base we're actually never going to do anything with. We're going to leave natural. It's just I want to make sure my fence is still intact because we have a lot of new players and I just want to make sure that it's obvious this is mine because I don't think this is claimed out here. I plan on changing that. I plan on having everything claimed, but. Something shoot at me? Is there another guy? There should be more to that patrol. I did get one of them when I was checking something. So it's possible I got the other guys without realizing it. Anyway, so this is my first patrol. Piece of cake. Scared the crap out of me earlier when I was prepping for the episode. And also I got shot at. I was right here and I got shot at. I'm like, what the heck is going on? <laughs> but anyway, um, so yes. My shaders work again with anti-aliasing. So what had happened was I had inadvertently clicked the render quality and knocked it down. I didn't knock it down to 0.5. I knocked it down to 1, which is why I didn't notice that was the problem. Had I knocked it down to 0.5, I would have noticed right away. But since I noticed, knocked it down to 1, I didn't quite realize what was going on. Oh, look, at I love that cube over there. So I put it back up to 2, full quality. So everything else is fine. Everything is working now. I really wish anti-aliasing would go up to like 8 or 16 with shaders, but in reality, I don't think any computer could handle it. Because I have, at the time, this computer is very new. It's like three months old or something. And it was the second fastest you could buy in terms of specs. So if my second fastest consumer quality computer would probably not even run if we had shaders with anti-aliasing at 16. Because right now I'm only getting like 100 and some frames per second at four times anti-aliasing. So that's probably why you don't have the option for 16. I just wish it were an option just for like, slow movement yay i got so much money i was going to edit that out every single time because it shows the update now but i'm not going to i just have a lot of money i need to spend it i apologize i don't spend as much as i could so anyway there's the story on the actually scene it works now shaders so i am so happy um i don't know what to say i'm just super happy okay i think we wasted enough time now that the sun is going to set soon so we need to get our citizen out quickly before the sun sets because um, I haven't slept, obviously. I just logged in the server. So I want my citizen to be, like, right here. And the citizen is going to be handing us a gift. I don't want to put the citizen on this, on the path block. Because path block seems to break a lot of stuff. I don't want to experiment. So let's go like this. And I think... Um, let's see, how does this work now? Do I... I can't remember how to put stuff on armor stand. There we go. It's been so long. Come here, dude. Come on. You can do this. I'm going to put him here. There we go. With his head. And his head is going to be... There we go. And he's going to be holding a gift. Right? Can't I... Why can't I give him a gift? I think you have to do... Is it that? There we go. Do I put the gift in there? Oops, except i got to be looking away so I can see what I'm doing. Oh, that's right. You have to type the CMI armor stand near if you don't click on them. I'm going to click on them. You have to click in the right spot. There we go. And then you can move them around. Visible name. Glowing. Invulnerable. Interactable. Gravity. Visible arms. Visible. Invisible. Where's the plate? There it is. Turn the plate off. And then I want to move them. Is it? Head. Here we go. Torso, left arm, right arm. To go... Um, right arm, wait, do you, you right click and left click, okay, so right click goes one way, left click goes the other, hold shift to make it ten times faster, oh, there we go, there we go, that's all I wanted to do, just hand me something, nothing too fancy, uh, I should have made them face this way more, that's okay, the Nopi citizen is offering me a gift, how cool is that, that is for you, Epona. Alrighty, next thing I want to do before it gets dark, which I don't think we're going to make it, is I wanted to hang up my banners. And then, hmm, I really wanted to fly at night. 
Okay, let's do this super fast. Let's hang up these banners. And then we might have a phantom or two come after us. Which wouldn't be such a bad thing, because we need some more phantom membranes. Oh, look at the shaders. Look at that. I feel like my world is back. I feel like everything is returned. Alright, let's see. Let's hang up these banners super fast. I am obviously running out of space. I'm gonna have to double up some things, I guess. Um... Should I put it down here? I don't want... See, I want a block between everything, but it's not going to work that way. So now we have to start going like that. That's fine. Let's put this guy up here. Can I reach? Let's just start right there. There we go. We'll keep sneaking in banners. Very nice. All right. Good. These are growing everywhere. All right. So we need to take a little nap, get some more milk, and grab my... Um, shulker box, which I've already filled with stuff for my build when we get to our destination oh look at that campfire oh my gosh that's so cool like oh my god here we go with the high breeds i'm still getting stuff in the wrong pens anyway okay here we go um anything in there i guess i could fill that up with some stuff i'll harvest some berries and put them in there oh yep that grew on pods though okay it's gonna grow just fine Alrighty, what do we need to do we need to grab some elk super fast oh my gosh i love all my new textures Oh my god, it's so awesome. I should have gotten a cow. Um, well, let's just do this for right now. Uh, let's see what else. Oh, I just love this. I gotta get a cake. I asked my wife, I'm like, what excuse can we have to buy or bake a cake? And I said, I need pictures of the side and the top. <laughs> see, this looks at me like I'm crazy. Oh, I mean, I am crazy, but let's <laughs> see, this looks at me. Alrighty, just checking my mail. Checking out the new drip textures. There they are. Make sure that they work because I did some editing behind the scenes. Yeah, they're working just fine, right? Yeah, good. Okay. Let's see. What should we do? Here's my shulker box of stuff. I need to add some things to that. I guess we can right now. While we're talking these out because the flight's only going to be a couple minutes. I want a lot of birch. I already have some birch. Let's bring some extra birch. Um... Anything else? I was just kind of going through my chest, just looking for things to bring, just to, like, you know, knock my memory in the, like, place. I think I already got scaffolding. Although we don't really need scaffolding, we're going to try to make use of it. Yeah, there's scaffolding. Okay, that should be good. Um, who sent me an email? Alrighty, so let's do this. We got our milk replacement. I think now we just need to sleep. I'm checking my list. Sorry, the armor stand thing after we put the citizen out front. The banners, the patrol was there. I was going to mend my elytra. Where is my elytra? Hang on. I need to bring this with us. This is a big deal. I was going to mend that, but we have this whole other thing here. And then I think you can repair with this, right? You just do a thing and you do that and... That's going to go quick. But that should be fine. Yeah. I'll just gonna repair with the anvil later if it breaks. And change that one mid-flight. Oh, we need rockets too. I thought I was prepared for this flight. Um, This is fireworks. I think that's going to shoot stuff. <laughs> Although I kind of want to bring them just to see what happens. <laughs> Alright, let's put our stuff on. I know why I thought I had a lighter on. Because in my um, creative world that I'm practicing my um, whatchamacallits my um texture pack i have elytra on already that's why i was confused all right let's start with that how do we look my new texture see i told you my elytra texture with enchantment is gonna look awesome if they're a map of the end um use dynamap oh it looks like lady hunter said the same thing i did so anyway there we go there is my texture in game with Enchantment. Okay. Um, let's see here. Yeah, it seems too simple. Okay, let's just go into bed. Actually, hang on. Let's um go here first. I can only sleep at night and what? What? Wasn't it? Wasn't it nighttime? It's dawn. Uh, that was weird. Maybe everybody's slept and it went fast. Because we have a thing set up where if, like, you know, half the people sleep, it goes faster. So maybe during my rambling, 
<laughs> during my rambling, three people slept and it was enough to make you go fast. Okay, that was very strange. All right, fine. We're ready to go. No, oops. I tried to open the gate or the door. Oh, yeah, there's my opponent's goat, um, goat thing that we got from our scavenger hunt. Okay. Let's see any more patrol spawning. Was it dark enough to be a patrol spawn or anything? I don't see any mobs at all. There's that goat or that cow. He has been there since the game started. Okay. Let's, uh, light is on, right? Okay. We're going to what? We got a long flight. The rest of the episode is going to be flying. 79. Negative 79. So that means west 7900 and south 7100. We're going in the far current southwest corner of the map. So as long as this works, ooh, then, um, oh, I got to clean up this disaster too. As long as this works, we don't get any like server leg where we drop out of the sky. This should be fine. I want to go slow enough that we can see. But, um, this should be a good screenshot, I think. Maybe like this. Let's go down so we can get below. Um, I want to be able to see the terrain and all the cool stuff. Yeah, that's not really going to work so well. Uh, first person. I know a lot of people like to fly in third. I don't. Oh, yeah, this is a giant ocean. So what I was trying to say before I got totally distracted. Oh, yes. Oh, look at that. Somebody claimed that. Um... I want to be able to see the train as we fly, so I want to go slowly. I don't want to, like, over go where we're rendered. I don't want to go beyond that, because I want to see how gorgeous this is. This is that, this is that like, thousand-block-long ocean <laughs> that we live next to. There's so much ocean out here. And we're going to talk through this. We're not going to make any cuts. We're just going to fly low to the ground so we can see... I'm trying to read chat as I go. Is there anything to see behind us? I don't think so. Nope. That's how big this ocean is. Oh, there's the railway. Going under the ocean. Out to storybook. Oh, whoa! What the heck? <laughs> what? This is new and such, I think. Yep. We need to tour this place, but I'm waiting to tour with Lady Vivian. Can we land on that block, do you think? Think I can land on that sphere? Nope tried actually it's a it's a um fence post so i don't i don't think we could anyway oh my gosh that was funny i turned around and bam cool nice to see this from the sky but yes we are going to tour this with lady vivian i'm not going to tour it alone look at the bamboo the other thing we're going to do since we're talking about plans i guess is i am going to do look at all my kelp textures i should be watching where i'm going shouldn't i so we don't waste too much time we are going to do a a server fly around and what i mean by that is oh i thought that was going to open up for me what we're going to do is we're just going to take an episode or even two or three where we just do this we just fly around the server and just check stuff out for like 20 minutes at a time but that's not right now i mean we're kind of doing that right now but we have a purpose today so let's put our hud up here we need Oh my gosh, I need to go 6,000 south. We should go a little bit more south. We're going to hit the border. I don't want to go along the border. That's boring. So let's ignore the HUD while we fly around here. Whoa! <laughs> oh my goodness, there's a village. This is awesome. We need to go pretty much... I mean, we have to go west too, but mostly south right now. So let's just do that. Let's have a look behind us here while we're being... Not very careful. Oh my gosh, that was so cool. I ran into... I think that was Nguyen such. Am I saying that right? Or New Nguyen New Lindenberg or something. I can't remember. Oh, there's a little shipwreck. Yeah. Looks like somebody made something out of that. Oh yeah, this is that like teeny tiny iceberg biome that we have. We have like this really tiny iceberg biome. Except... Yeah, that's, yeah, that's it. The tiny, tiny iceberg is hilarious. Uh, something else you have to do is build in Lady Vivian's iceberg area. So we have lots of plans. I have them all written out. We're also going to take the Great Northern Road. Oh, Ultra Monument. Um, the no Great Northern Road built by our server engineer slash admin, Chip Bennett. He um, built a road due north from Spawn all the way to the border and keeps expanding it. And a lot of really cool things along the way. So that's an entire episode or two. 
just traveling the northern road. And we're going to do that by horse. We'll do that on horseback. But again, not today. See how much ocean we have? Where's my light durability? All right, so let's see. When the numbers line up, south and west, then we'll go to diagonal. But for right now, we're going to go south to catch up. Something else I'm going to do, which isn't part of the server, is I'm going to do a little tour of my um, personal creative world that I test textures on. Because I was flying around to do that kelp video. And that is probably my second favorite seed I'd, I've ever seen, is my creative world for textures. My first favorite was my very first seed back when I had a YouTube channel that I deleted years ago. We're talking like, I think it was like when 1.9 dropped or even 1.8. I had a YouTube channel. Terrible. Terrible microphone. Couldn't hear me. I was scared. Um, but the seed for that was absolutely gorgeous. Spawn was like a birch biome right next to um, well now they're called mountains. But oh my gosh, it was gorgeous. But got rid of all that. Didn't save the world for some reason. That was like two computers ago. Ooh, what's going on here? And we're going nice and slowly. Well, this is cool. Let's just go through this little river. Oh, how awesome is this? All right, so now we need to go south and west. So we're still going more south than we are west. So let's go this way. Again, negative 7,900. Are we going to get there before nightfall? I hope so. I want to light up this little island at least. Because I haven't slept now, remember. Because I was I missed night. <laughs> <laughs> so I didn't get to sleep. Ooh, there's a little ravine. Um, so I don't want to overshoot the render just because I want to see it. So what are we doing here? 79 and 71. So let's go more diagonal here. Don't want to hit the water. 79... And 71, I hope we get there by nightfall. Like I said, I want to light up this thing. At least put a bed down and some torches. Then we can sleep. And then we'll have a place to build in the next episode. Um, what are we looking for durability? We're good. Let's see. Oh, here we go. Are these islands yet? Oh, yeah. I'm on Dynamap. I'm on Dynamap. Zoomed are ready to go. Oh, good. We're going exactly diagonally towards it. We're going to fly over another ocean monument, but it should be far enough away we won't have mining fatigue. Oh, that's a... Whoa, hang on. That was gorgeous. Let's try to get a screenshot of this. Snap on some screenshots as I fly through. Wow. Isn't that beautiful? Wow. I'm snapping screenshots like crazy. Wow, that was gorgeous. Might have to come back here for something. Jeez. That was cool. All right, let's see here. Oh, more. Hey, if I need some tall flowers, I can get some. Oh, let's keep going. Don't run anything. All right, where are we here? I'm not going to... I'm going to take the HUD off and just use Dynamap now. But we should be getting to some islands. Yes, yeah, so this is actually an island here. Oh, no, it isn't. There's somewhere there's a... Well, some flower biome. There's a dark oak forest on it. It's just an island. That's dark oak forest. I thought that was kind of cool. Look at this. Gorgeous. And again, these are just the enhanced default shaders. Here we go. Now we're reaching the little islands. Okay, so my island. Let's see if I can pick it out here. What was that? Yep, there's one. Ooh, whoa. Hang on. This isn't my island, but I want to check it out anyway. All right, here we go. Oh, there we go. Oh, shoot. Got stuck on the ground. I'm stuck in the ground. There we go. This is a cool little island. This isn't the one I was looking for. Or was it? No. This was one I was looking at, but no, I decided not to do this one. Well, that's kind of cool, but not really buildable without doing major terrain change I don't want to do. All right, can we... Um, how are we going to fly off of this thing? Just go like this. There we go. Is that the ocean monument? Oh, that's a ruin. Hit the water. Okay, my island is right. Is it this one? Ooh, that was bad. Was it this one? Oh, yeah, this is it, isn't it? It's not exactly 
little hillier, I think. Is this it? 79.40 and 71.50. Yep. This is my island. So what we're going to do... See, I want to make sure we couldn't see anything else. So we're going to have to, like, take down that island right there so it's underwater. And maybe we'll keep that one. But that one's going away. Um, what are we going to do? Let me get my stuff back together here and get a bed down and um, some torches down. Um, we're going to make something out of this water. We're going to make them into waterfalls that come off the edge. Maybe put a, make a little creek through here. And then... We need to flatten out a little bit because we're going to build a house that is really big facing the sunset. So like it's going to be, you know, like a regular, regular door. I don't see that ocean monument. It'd be like a regular door on the east side, but on the west side, there's going to be, it's just going to like go up towards the west so that we have the nice huge picture window for the sunset um with our gigantic spawn rates now if i'm here and i have a spot that's not lit up we're gonna get so many monster spawns oh my goodness even when we're working on our own little island we're gonna be inundated with mobs so we get every inch lit up which i will do at off camera i'll come you know i'll come through here and do a very systematic, like, grid pattern of the torches, you know. So there isn't anything that is below 7. Um, this is going to be opened up. And we're going to, like I said, we're going to have, like, waterfalls come through and little river underground. So what I need to do is get ready here. A couple things I need to do. First of all, we can put... Oh, we need this. And why did I grab so much water? Oh, that's to make the waterfalls and things. Of course I have a renewable water source, though. We need my bed. Need some more torches. And we need to start powder. Oh, yeah, that's the case. I need more. I'm going to start building stuff. I only need one door. And then this stuff can go away. Where's my other elytra? Uh, did I not bring two elytras? One. And I'm still wearing it. <laughs> I guess I screwed that up. Okay. And two. Okay, so what do we need to do? We need to figure out which way is west. Which I knew that was east. This way is going to be west. So that's going to be the sunset way. So our house is going to be like right in here with um with a big window facing that way. I just want to get this started and then we'll sign off here because we're going to do the building in the next episode. I just wanted to show you what we're doing. I'm going to bed down so I can sleep. And that will be the end of it. So that was a nice flight. Like I said, we're actually going to have some episodes where we just fly around the server for who knows how long. Um, yeah, we're just going to do that. All right, so I think that's going to be it for this episode. I need to get a bed down somewhere. I don't know where the bed is going to end up being until I build around it. But I'm going to put a bed down right here so I can sleep. Hopefully something doesn't sneak up, like come up, you know, when I'm... Oh, I forgot about the stick thing. We'll, we'll be sleeping and a monster will come up over the corner or something. Hopefully that doesn't happen. But I'm going to get ready to set a claim in the next episode. And we'll start building. Oh, I'm doing the wrong button. There we go. And we'll start building our tiny little island getaway. You know, this island is a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be. That's okay. We'll have a little yard. Maybe some chickens. And dangerous cliffs. Because that's always fun. Hopefully you enjoyed it. And that's all I've got to say in this one. I'll catch you on the next one.